guys so we are coming to unlock an iphone which is unavailable with signal so to put your device in dfv mode then register your device then you click on options then you click on passcode which is on ramdex then make sure that register your device first before you do it make sure you downloaded the ramdex of that device this will take you to the mega mega website so that you can download it you can download your ram decks after this click on ram decks files then make sure you choose when you need iphone iphone ios 15 make sure you choose the recommended one then look for your that's your ram decks type go back here then choose that your ram decks type make sure that it matches the one that you are choosing and make sure that you downloaded it After the download has finished, locate that your file that you just downloaded. Make sure that you copy it. You can use copy or cast which one you want, whichever one you want. Then click on lib, then click on boot then choose ios 15 when you are on ios 16 make sure that you choose ios 16 i was already having a ram disk in it so i have to delete it then put the new one in it if you are loving this video make sure that you subscribe then put your comment in the comment section after that click on start then click on boot iDevice So some of you your device your device can't be boot over here it cannot be pawned of you over here so you have to do it manually so if you want a video on how to boot your device manually put it in the comment section so that I will do a video on how to do it so right now my 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 own won't work unless I pawned of it manually using gasta and so I will go so I'll pause the video then boot my device manually so sorry guys if you want a video on how to do it leave it in the comment section so that I will explain it to you on how to do it so I've boot it manually then I'll click on it this will work you see It is installing the drivers. Please, if you are loving this video, make sure that you subscribe and like the video for me. You see this is a driver's problem so this is something that we can fix it's very easy so make sure that you select that apple device then update it then choose apple apple i device drivers so this one will work make sure that you subscribe for me so you can see that it has put in SS mode successfully 
so you have to back up your device now make sure that you back up your device so it will do so it, the backup has been done successfully so make sure you check the backup folder to see whether the backup has been done successfully so that you can erase your device so check it you can see that i have a another another one here so it wasn't the one i did so i have to delete it and left and leave the one that i just did over here you can see it is 8 kilo 18 kilobytes so now the backup i confirm the backup is all right now i have to erase my device you can also flash your device whichever one you want so by me i choose to erase my device successfully your phone will now boot you can see the apple logo then your phone will boot so wait your phone will boot and the surface of your phone will become iphone lock to owner so don't panic we have already made a backup so you're able to activate it then the signal will work for you so my boot has been booted successfully so i have to choose ram takes bypass again then I have to put my device in DFU mode. If you don't know how to put a device in DFU mode, you can search it, or the or put your put a device in recovery mode. The tool will show you how to put it in DFU mode. Make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel. As I'm saying, please subscribe, then like it for me, then put a comment in the comment section. And if you want a video on how to point your your device manually, you can put in the comment section so that I will teach you. So with this, you know that I have to put put my device manually. How to point your it manually? You see, it got stuck right before trigger. If you see this, that means that broke will not work. It will work for you, but you have to point you of it manually because gaster don't usually work on windows but if you point you up point you of it manually it will work you see i've done it on you of it manually so now you can see that it will start working sometimes it takes long before it works so you have to be patient so please if you are enjoying this video make sure that you like and subscribe and make sure that you do not to the creator of that too so that we can make bypass free <coughs> so now it has been pointed off manually so you can see you have to click on activate so that your device will be activated with signal <coughs> please make sure that you donate to the creator of that too so that we can make bypass free you see it has been activated successfully it's very easy very easy to use the tool is very very easy to use so make sure that you like and subscribe to my youtube channel for me and if the thing come like this you can either reboot your i device or you can click on done then click the power button if i use iphone 7 click on power button and power down the device will boot it for you you can click on the reboot i device which any which any anyone you want so my device is now being booted so you have to be patient with me so i've got so you have to click on trust on your device then click on i have trusted this device then it will work you will see your device has been activated you see right now you can see activated device has been activated successfully and you can use signal and 
you can see right now it has been activated this is the device right now it has been activated and make sure that you like and subscribe to my youtube channel make sure you like it 